までお越しください。ウィンスウィートナウアムインヤマノテラインヘディングトゥイケブクロステーションイケブクロステーションイズインノースパートオブトキョーインマイオピニオンイツディタウンフォーヤングアダウスコンペアトゥシンジュクエンドシブヤトゥデイアウィオトライワンオブディモスポピュラーコンベイヤーズシレストランクラッツスペシャルニューメニュースシンスディハブソメニカインズアムノシュアーハウメニディッシーズアイケントライ But I will try to eat as many as I can though. I'm heading to northeast exit now. Firstly, let me show you how to get to Kura from Ikebukuro Station. It's a bit far, but not complicated. After you get up from northeast exit, cross the big street, then turn right. If you turn left on this corner, you will get to Sunshine Street, which is one of the most popular streets in Ikebukuro. But if you want to go to Kurazushi Restaurant, Just keep straight. After past the street, you will find Matsumoto Kiyoshi, which is a popular discounted drugstore, and also Don Quixote, my favorite discounted store. You can find many interesting items and souvenirs here. Speaking of 100 Japanese yen conveyors restaurant, several years ago, we only could find them in countryside. In the big city, we still had the conveyor sushi restaurant, but it's not 100 Japanese yen for a plate. They usually charge more. However, recently, we can find 100 Japanese yen conveyor sushi restaurant in the big city too, so I'm happy. Here we go, we arrived to Kurazushi restaurant. It's in the basement floor. You can just go down by the stairs next to the door. This store is usually really crowded. If you want to come here, I recommend to make a reservation by official app or visit the restaurant afternoon time. It's around 3 30 pm, so I believe it won't be crowded much. There is a display in the entrance. If you have a reservation, push orange sign, and if you don't have a reservation, push blue sign. Today, I don't make reservation, so I push blue sign. For now, seems like waiting time is about 5 minutes. Let's wait. There is a place you can wait next to the display. After your number was called, go to check in by the red display in front of the cashier. After check in, you will receive the receipt. There is a table number on the receipt, so you just need to find the table with number. And it seems like this is my table, so let's eat! In conveyor's restaurant, you have to make tea by yourself. You can find tea cups on top, and there is tea powder on the table. Two scoops are a good amount for one cup, and you can get hot water from here. Firstly, they will ask you if you want to play Big Kurapon game. It's free and fun, so just say yes here. I will show you how it works later. On the display, there is a language menu at the corner. You can choose whether Japanese, English, Chinese. Today, for this video, let me choose English. I usually order it in Japanese though. Oh, sweet, we are in Kura in Ikebukuro. Hey guys, welcome to Ryan's TV. I'm Ryan s e n o k o I wanna try it one by one and then let me see how many dishes I can eat. Well, to be honest, I can't eat that much, so I'm not sure it would be fun or not. But at least I can introduce many dishes to you guys, right? So I hope it could be interesting. <laughs> Hopefully. Anyway, let me order the dishes. So <laughs> let's order it. You know, whenever I come to Kurazushi restaurants, there are too many menus, so I have a hard time to make a decision what to eat. Wow, look at this. This one is the today's special. They have eight sweet shrimps, but only 110 Japanese yen. So let me get that. I tried to find this special menu over here, but I can't find it. Let me see if I can find it in Japanese menu. Yeah, it seems like they d o e s n t change the picture, they just change the languages. If I can't find it in the English menu, then probably I can't find it in Japanese menu. So let me change it to English again. <laughs> It's okay, forget it. Let me start from the special menus. So let me get aged f a r i tuna. Also, this marinated scallop. Cereal. Why not? It's sea urchin too. One, two, three, four. So for now, I ordered four dishes and it's already almost 1000 Japanese yen. Wow. 
All right, here we go. Here is the first one. Seared ale. Smells so good. So even before I stirred it, there are another three dishes came already. It looks pretty good. Oh, by the way, you can find a bunch of... Oh, by the way, you can find a bunch of chopsticks in the box. All right, let me see which one to start. Let's start with this sea eel. By the way, sea eel in Japanese is unagi. Unagi. It's really sweet and it's soft. At the same time, I can smell the really good charcoal flavor. Hmm, loving it. 200 Japanese yen? It's a pretty good deal. Actually, this looks like one dish, but there are two dishes inside. Yep, so here is one and then another one. All together, 200 Japanese yen. That was good. And the next, let's go for the uni. Oh, by the way, you can find wasabi on the table. I love wasabi. All right, let's eat uni. So place the wasabi. By the way, sea urchin in Japanese is uni. Uni. Mm. It's sweet, really good with sisal leaves. It's really good for 200 Japanese yen. All right, next, let's go for the scallop. Scallop is one of my favorite dish. Scallop in Japanese is hotate. Hotate. Ah, look at this. It's a big scallop. Oh, it must be good. Mm. The scalp was really sweet and soft. I really loved it. I think I placed too much wasabi, so it was really spicy. I really like wasabi, placed too much sometimes, and then it became super spicy. But still, I'm loving it though. And the next, it's fatty tuna. By the way, fatty tuna in Japanese is chu toro. Well, this time, I just put a little wasabi because it would be too spicy. Mm. It's pretty nice. I used to study in the States and I know that. Definitely you can eat the fatty tuna with 200 Japanese yen. So if you visit Japan, you got to try that. Anyway, still, our lunch just started. So let's order more for the second round. Let me order this seared southern bluefin tuna. I don't know what it is, but it sounds good. So let me order this. Okay, so order. Oh, they have a regular salmon, which is 100 Japanese yen, but seems like this one is special salmon. I want to check how how special it is. Oh, and maybe this is the one they were talking about. Double sweet shrimp. This is 100 Japanese yen only, so let me order this. And squid. It's my favorite. So, four more dishes are coming. Let's wait. Here we go. Yes, we got the another four dishes. This one is sweet shrimp, salmon, bluefin tuna, and squid. Okay, so let me start with sweet shrimp. So this one is a double sweet shrimp. I think two sweet shrimp for only 100 Japanese yen is pretty cheap. But this time, now they have a promotion and we have a four each, so totally eight. Sweet shrimp in Japanese is ama ebi. Ama ebi. Well, it's pretty good. I could eat this sweet shrimp like five dishes. I could be full with 500 Japanese yen. Oh, by the way, speaking of the sweet shrimp, I don't know the reason why, but the sweet shrimp in the state was really expensive. At the first time when I went to US and then I ate the sweet shrimp, I was so surprised. Of course, the quality is different, but in Japan, this kind of sweet shrimps, you can eat it only with 100 Japanese yen. However, when I was in the States, the sweet shrimp was like 10 or 15 US for two pieces. I don't know the reason why, but it was so expensive. Does someone know the reason why? If you know the reason, please let me know by the comment. Anyway, if you like the sweet shrimp, you can eat it in Japan. And next, let me try this fancy salmon here. Oh, you know what? Now I realize this one is a bit fattier than regular one. By the way, salmon in Japanese is sake, but many people call this salmon. So you can call it salmon. Let me eat this fancy salmon. Mm, Definitely compared to the regular one, this one is fattier. It's sweet and nice. 200 Japanese yen, I think it worth it. And the next one. This one is Aburi Maguro no Akami, which is a bluefin tuna. Looks interesting. I'm wondering how it tastes like. Since this is my first time, let me try it without wasabi. 
Mm. It tastes like a tuna steak. Outside it's kind of hard, but inside really soft. When I bite it, I can feel the really good tuna flavor. Nice. All right, the next one is squid. Squid is really simple, but uh, still it's my favorite. By the way, squid in Japanese is ika, ika. Oh shit. I like this 100 Japanese yen sushi is kind of chewy squid. I didn't grow up in the rich family, so I got used to it with 100 Japanese yen squid and I feel it's good, so that's why I like it. <laughs> Whatever you like, it's a good food, right? Why not? Mm. And let's go for the third round. Let me order something different. Oh, I kind of get bored with sushi. Iberico buta, looks good. Oh, this eel egg and the shrimp tempura sushi. All right, here we go. In the third round, this time it's not the low fish. Those are totally different sushi style. The first one is eel and egg. Look at this half boiled egg, looks good. Mm. Eel sweet soy sauce really good with half boiled egg. Excuse me, this place is kind of getting noisy, but I uh, hope you guys can hear me. And the next, it's a pork, Iberico buta. <laughs> <laughs> it must be good. Mm, it's really soft and uh, this sweet soy sauce sauce. Really nice. And the next, this is one of my favorite dish. It's shrimp tempura sushi. I know, maybe some people don't think that's sushi, but uh, even it's 100 Japanese yen and then also coming by the belt. However, it is warm and crispy. So if you like tempura, definitely you can order it. It's only 100 Japanese yen. I think already I'm full. Well, sorry if you are expecting that I'm eating like a food monster, but uh, <laughs> I think I can't eat anymore and I'm satisfied. All right, so now it's time for Big Krapong, which is a game that maybe we can win this Pagachapong. So let's do it. You can just place it here. One, two, three, four, and five. Each five plates, you can play Big Krapong. And if you win this game, you can get the Gachapong. <laughs> Oh wow. Oh, I thought he lost. But uh, win! Sweet! Actually, there is a gashapon machine on top. <laughs> Definitely, I didn't expect that I'm winning. Wow, I am pretty lucky. <laughs> yes. This is what usually happens. You can't win. <laughs> I thought I won. And this is it. So it was a 17 plates. Before I leave here, let me see what I win. Oops. So I think it's a magnet. This is what you get from the Kura Gachapon. So, if you don't win, don't be so sad. Anyway, it was a good meal, so let's get the check. Hey. So now, I need to go to cashier with this recipe. Let's go. You can just scan the receipt and you can pay. Wow, that's expensive. Maybe it's my first time to eat this much here. Now, let's go out and check Ikebukuro town just a little bit. Well, seems like it start raining. Actually, it's Suyu, which is a rainy season in Japan. Anyway, I don't bring the umbrella, so let's go get the umbrella at the convenience store. You can buy umbrella in any convenience store. There are two sizes, 70cm and 65cm. 70cm, about 100 Japanese yen expensive, but I recommend to get bigger one. Hi, Adamo. I have a bunch of stuff in my backpack, so I can't make it wet. Still, there are many people haven't used the umbrella. If I don't have my camera backpack with me, I wouldn't buy umbrella neither though. Anyway, since we are here, let's go to check Ikebukuro Sunshine Street. This is the popular street in Ikebukuro. There are many restaurants and stores. Also, you can find aquarium and observatory too. Usually, it's a busy street. 
but because of the raining, less people walking now. Seems like rain getting weaker. Let's go to check west part of Ikebukuro as well. Oh nice, seems like rain has stopped for now. After walking a little bit, rain has started again. This year, rainy season has started much earlier compared to usual year, so hopefully it will end earlier too. I like to listen to heavy rain sound in the house by a window, but I still prefer sunny days though. Speaking of vaccination situation in Japan, as I shared on my Twitter account, almost 1 million people receiving vaccination per day, it's much faster than my expectation. Hope I can have vaccination soon too. Alright, I think this place is not gonna be wet. Well, actually, raining getting heavier. So I came into the station. This place, there is a roof, so I can shoot the video here. State of emergency will be finally gone at the end of this week. So probably I can find more places that I can shoot the video. Don't worry, after the rainy season, I will start traveling more and more. So please look forward to it. Speaking of myself, I'm a travel photographer. I have taken many photos like this. So please don't forget to check my Instagram account too. Speaking of my channel, there are over 300 videos about Japan and the Japanese food. So if you are thinking of traveling to Japan in the future, please don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notifications so that you will not miss my new video and a surprise live stream. Alright, so this video pretty much that's it. Thank you so much for watching my video. See you in the next video. Arigatou! Bye bye! You know what? I totally didn't expect that would be raining. Actually, tomorrow, day after tomorrow, and then next next day, it will be raining. Yes, so many raining days in Tsuyu, which is rainy season in Japan. Definitely, if you are thinking of traveling to Japan in the future, you want to avoid this season. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the video. So, see you in the next video. Arigato! Have a great day. Seno ka! Oops. <laughs> there was the stairs. Anyway, seno ka! Bye bye.